Transportation makes up one third of all greenhouse gas emissions in the United States. Walking doesn't emit anything. Well, except for what I breathe. But the trees can easily take care of that. I'm getting my exercise in. I sleep better at night and I feel better because I'm helping take care of my world. My school is 3.8 miles away and it takes me an hour and four minutes to get there. I'm walking at about 3.6 miles an hour. All of those soccer practices are paying off. My car is a 2013 Toyota Highlander Hybrid and it gets 28 miles per gallon. So today I'm saving 0.27 gallons of fuel. Every gallon of gasoline burned creates 19.6, about 20 pounds of CO2. By not driving today, I save five pounds of emissions. If I walked every day for a week, I'd save 27 pounds of CO2. After a month, 106 pounds. And after a year, it would be 959 pounds. And I did some calculations on this really cool site on the EPA. You should check it out. That's equivalent to just over seven trees grown for 10 years. Okay, let's think bigger. There are 76 students in my grade. If we all walk to school, that's 33,000 pounds of carbon that wouldn't be emitted. That's equivalent to a year sequestration of an 18 acre forest. No, wait, there are 650 students in my entire school. If we all walked, that's 623,000 pounds of carbon that wouldn't be released. That's equivalent to 10,700 incandescent lamps being switched for LEDs. That's equivalent to a year sequestration of a 335 acres of forest. It's the same amount of carbon that it takes to charge 34.4 million iPhones. Now that makes a difference. Walking today has been great. It's nice and sunny, but in Bellevue, walking every single day is not an option. My house is too far away from school, and if my parents tried walking to work every day, they'd be walking over 20 miles a day. We simply can't walk. It takes too much time. It's not practical. But what if we could? What if schools and malls and grocery stores and parks were designed for higher density living so that we all could walk? What if there were bike paths everywhere and everyone took the bus? Walkable neighborhoods.